Having lived a time like this, who of us would have said that we would come to a situation when everything comes to a standstill? The powers that be, the nations of the world, the powerful people that we know, the systems of the world, everything coming down to a halt. Because God allowed a virus, just allowed a virus to come through and has disrupted everything. When I see this, I see a God who has power. I see a God who controls the universe in his hands. He decides what happens every day, every minute, every hour. And so we can look to that God in every detail of our lives and trust to him, even the minutest of details, because he's concerned. He knows what happens when. Now, we're finding ourselves at home with a lot of time, with a lot of time to do many things. My question is, what are you doing with the time uh, that you're having at home? And I subject and submit us to the fact that this should be a time when we will have a history, we will have a record, we'll have something that will tell the people who are coming after us that the God, the Sovereign, the Master of the Universe, during our time, He allowed us to go through this. And it was a trying moment, but He came through for us. He did it for us. He gave us victory. He gave us all that we needed, even when we were so fearful. My brothers and sisters, there is a God who is concerned about every detail of your life. You can trust Him. He knows when the sun comes up and when the sun goes down. He knows when the moon comes and when the stars are out there. He is concerned about every detail of your life. You can trust him with your life. Amen.